Right, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can launch Mafia 3 even if you're having problems with the Mafia 3 launcher. Uh, I was having issues with the game not starting, which I can show you here. If I click play, uh, click this on there. Uh, see, there's actually a different error I used to get. Um, just probably off a bit. Normally, I have the issue with the back of the lot launching. Windows try to find a solution, you can't find one. And you may think, ah, oh, that's it, here we go, that's the classic one. Windows, I try to find an issue, uh, try and solve the issue, but yeah, basically it can't. So I close that, and the issue I discovered trial and error isn't actually matter itself, just the launch a program. So what I'm do is, um, you can still play the game, and the way around it is basically just bypass the launcher. So if we select Matthew 3 like we've got here, we'll right click, and now we've got properties, and so we this menu here. Now we've got tabs on the top there, we want to get local files, so we've got here browse local files. Now this opens up the location where the game's installed, Obviously, yours may vary depending on how many hard drives you've got, etc. Uh, it'll probably look something very similar to that. Now, what I want to do is open this to make it easier. And if we scroll down, here we go. So, there we go. That's the launcher, which tries to start but fails. And there's actual Mafia 3. So, ignore the launcher, double click Mafia 3, and you should find, find the game will run absolutely fine. You don't actually need the launcher program. Give it a few seconds. And we'll see the game starting up. There we go, there's the music, there's the game loading. And in a moment now, the main menu's come up. So I did lots of googling to try and find the answer, and nothing I tried actually worked. If anything, to make it worse. So uh, there you go. Basically, ignore the launcher and start direct. Back for itself. 